Hi everyone, welcome back to my class. Students, this is revision part 2. Uh, Naan nimge heild haage, nima board examination preparation ge maartti ruvanta revision part 2 to score 5 marks from the lesson How do organisms reproduce? So, yik already nanu part 1 nali nimge uh, sexual reproduction andre yenu, pollination andre yenu, self pollination, cross pollination, fertilization yaavriti agate, Male gametes and reenu, female gametes and reenu, idanella explain madhini with clear cut. I hope nimge a video, the li heli one the yella information artha agidenta. So, ivatina class ali, I am going to start with the sexual reproduction in the human beings. So, sexual reproduction in human beings na nim artha marko bek ondre. First, you need to understand about the reproductive system in male and female. So, reproductive system nimge gotidre. Sexual reproduction is easy to do. So, firstly, today I am going to start with the male reproductive system. So, male reproductive system the functions in the examination. So, you should know the different parts of the male reproductive system. So, parts go beko and other functions kuda go beko. Clear? So, for parts in the we have testis, we have scrotum, we have vast difference, we have epididymis, and male gade glands barate nimge, uh, that is the prostate glands, seminal vesicle. Copper's gland could have been my textbook mention Agila. And then you also have the sperm duct and we also have the penis. So Istella could have new till First, to write the function, you should know the parts. So Yelleli Yavia part irritant and imge mind mapping bandre, you can write the function of it very easy. So first test is bagi matadana. Okay. So what is mean by test is yes to test is irate human male reproductive system ali and then you till call beku. See, testis bagge maatharada, there are two testis in the human male reproductive system. Two testis andri, a pair of testis andri, testicles, yara do testicles irathe. Idara use eno, what is the use of testis? Testis will produce the sperm. Sperm produce maadake, help maadate and it is also helpful for the production or the secretion of a hormone called as testosterone. Il note bodhun and highlight maadhi dhini testosterone ana word na. So, testosterone yaki highlight maadhi andre boys nalli kaanu vanta yella secondary sexual characters yavaga when they attain the puberty yavaga body nalli external changes kaanisate so a changes ella all of a sudden kaanala so as they enter to the puberty lot of changes they can see so that is because of the release or the secretion of testosterone you should know so testosterone and sperms yerdu kuda it is being produced in the testicles Second part given the scrotum. Scrotum na function eno. See scrotum is actually a bag like structure. So this is protecting the testis. So scrotum ya ke protect maartai de why it is outside the abdominal cavity and the you should know. See generally sperms na produce maadake. Sperms na produce maadake testicles ge it need lower temperature. But number body na liye na agate the temperature is higher compared to the temperature in the scrotum. Okay. For the production of sperm, the testicles need the lower temperature. That is the reason scrotum will be present just below the abdominal cavity. Abdomen and the stomach. Nima hotte ya kela bagadalli ena agirathe male reproductive system bagge maadharthi dini. So human male ali hotte ya kela bagadalli ena agirathe there is presence of scrotum along with the penis. So function you have understood. So next one the epididymis. New note bodu epididymis illi de. So epididymis is a region where it will store the sperm. So iga produce aadanta sperm ina agate. Bandu epididymis ali uh, collect agate and it is also acting like a passage. Sperms na kalso anta ondo passage kuda agate. And then coming to the vast difference. Vast difference actually it is acting like a duct to pass the sperms. So epididymis ali store agiru anta sperms ina agate. It will enter through the vast difference to the sperm duct understand so what is the function of the epididymis you can see observe here the epididymis is a tube like structure understand so it is a tube like structure which stores the sperms and it stores the sperms and it also helps to pass the sperm next just above the epididymis coil like structure then you know about the coil like epididymis uh, epididymis epididymis coil like structure ide. So, this coil like structure is the extension for the vast difference. So, the aim of the so the vast difference is a tube like structure. It is a tube like structure which is emerging from in the lower part of the epididymis. So, in the aim of it will send the sperms to the ejaculatory duct. 
So which is the ejaculatory duct? You can observe here. See, this is the ejaculatory duct. From this region, the sperms will enter and it comes out. So this is now the ejaculatory duct. Here, I told you, right? So So this is a coil tubule-like structure. This is called as vas deferens. Epididymis is this region just attached to the testis. So it helps in storing the sperms which is being produced by the testicles. I hope you have understood. So next part to new tilkol be kagiradu, most important is penis. So what is the function of penis? See penis is actually muscular copulatory organ. Copulatory organ ya kheltivi, ya ke muscular because it is completely made up of muscles. Penis is completely made up of muscles. Hence it is called as muscular copulatory organ. Clear? So, yavaga sperms eject agate, ejaculatory duct in the inagate, a muscular copulatory organ erect agate. Andre, it will extend in its size. So, that inagate sperms will come out through the sperm duct or through penis. I hope you have understood. So, penis is a muscular copulatory organ. So, copulatory organ yake and it will extend. Copulation madate. Okay. So, copulation and movement, forward and backward movement madate. Understand? So, it will help in discharging the sperm. Forward and backward movement So, that, that muscular organ will help in ejaculating the sperms. So, next one, the urethra. See, urethra is a common passage. So, you know, the urethra, it is a common passage. Here, you can observe. See, this urethra, which is present inside the penis. So, this will help in passing both the sperm as well as the urine. This is a common passage. Urine pass madaku, hangu sperms na pass madaku kuda. One is a common passage. The urethra. Okay. So then, and you also have to understand about the glands. Very, very important. Prostate gland and seminal vesicle bagi sakastu bari keli dare. So prostate gland and reenu. See, prostate gland is a gland. It secretes the milky fluid that helps in the sperm's mobility. And re, mobility and re, movement. The sperm in the epididymis in the vast difference mukandra higi bartha ide entandre illi bandaga illi ondu gland ide you have observed you would have observed that nan iga diagram torusdaga a gland en madutte illi sperm bandaga enagutte milky fluid na secretion ana add madutte so add madodrinda enagutte entandre ee sperm's movement easy agutte sperm's munde move aguvaga easy agi move agutte so that is the function of prostate gland so, seminal vesicle na function eno. Seminal vesicle en madatha and it also produces the viscous like fluid and that also help in the mobility. Apart from that en madatha andre, sperms na alive agi dakke. Andre iga male body in the female body volgade, sperms enter agbe kadre en agate. There is some gap. So, a gap in the eno mu agbe kadre sperm, it has to be alive. So, that will be, that medium will be created by the seminal vesicle. I hope you got a clear picture what is meant by what is the function of seminal vesicle and uh, the prostate gland. It, see it is given here it produces the viscous fluid which helps in sperm's mobility in the female. Okay so female olagade sperms enter beku and it has to be also alive. So this will be looking after by the uh, fluid which has been produced by the seminal vesicle. You have to note it down this. See I have also mentioned about the corpus gland here. See, corpus gland is a gland which secretes the mucus. Mucus and reino jelly like substance. So, yavaga e mucus release agate corpus gland in the andre, yavaga sexual activity agbeko, atva yavaga sperms discharge agute, aam on the time alien lien agate before the sperms discharge, yavaga sperm horagade barbeko, aam on the moment go munche in agate, this mucus will be released with the help of corpus gland. So, all these things you should know. So, functions na thil kolwaga, ella functions na kuda niu clear agi thil kolbeko. Clear? So, I hope you have understood all the functions. Functions na niu complete agi thil koli. And next, coming to human female reproductive system. Human female reproductive system bagge kuda tumba ne important agi niu thil kolbeko. Okay. Human female reproductive system do kuda functions keel tare parts and functions yaradu kuda niu gotir beko. So, parts na noda dadri you can observe here. See, there is a pair of ovaries, one on either side of the uterus and there is a pair of fallopian tube and this region we call it as uterus where the embryo will develop. And the magu yali develop agate, uterus yali develop agate. Okay? And this region we call it as vagina. And you also should know about 
the X that is the female sex cells which is present in the ovary. Okay, these many parts you should uh, know and the functions of these parts also you should know. So, if function no na, so function no the ovaries buggy first you have to understand. The ovaries are the region which is present in the female reproductive system. It is help for the production of egg. Eggs andre female gametes only produce agate, ovary only produce agate. Apart from the female sex cell, ovary also help in the production of progesterone and estrogen. E progesterone and estrogen, they both are the uh, hormones which are responsible for the secondary sexual characters in the female. Iga male ali yavriti na wo, uh, hair on the face, atwa voice box cracks, appearance of pimples on the face, atwa broadening of chest anta nodhi. Haage female ali start of menstruation cycle, atwa uh, development of memory glands. Memory glands pandu milk feed maada ke important uh, women ge. And then uh, appearance of pimples, Enlargement of breast agirbodu, hip agirbodu, growth of hair in the genital and the private parts ali. Idella kuda female ali aguanta changes. Yavaga, when there is secretion of the female hormone, which is called as testosterone and the estrogen. So, idu important agi thilkol beko. Okay, so next bandhu niu you have to understand about the fallopian tube. So, fallopian tube na OV duct anta kuda karitare. So, both are same. Fallopian tube and one day, OV duct and one day. So, fallopian tube na importance yenu on tandre. Actually, yen agatendre. Every month, one matured egg will be released from the ovary and that will be stayed in the fallopian tube. Fallopian tube ali irate. So, in matured egg, yavaga sperm bandu meet agate. Yen agate, the sperm will, sperm will encounter the egg. It will encounter the egg. So, yavaga sperm egg na meet agate in agate, there is fertilization. As a result of this, zygote, zygote and reno single celled organism, and then future baby, future baby and the inhale that is the single cell, first step of single celled organism, we call it as zygote. Is zygote form agadu fallopian tubally. I repeat once again, see, fallopian tube is acting as a site of fertilization. Idhana place where site of fertilization takes place and the healthy be ya ke andre every month over in the release other the one matured egg will be waiting for the sperm for the fertilization so sperm ya waga enter agate vagina in the when it meets the egg sperm when it meets the egg in agate there is formation of single celled organism which we call it as zygote zygote and the karitvi clear so, this is a site of fertilization, fallopian tube, atwa oviduct, eradu kuda one the answer. So, next you must know about the uterus. See, uterus is a bag-like structure. So, it is a bag-like structure. So, it is a bag-like structure. So, it is a So, every month, uterus is a bag-like structure. There is formation of thick layer of blood vessels, which we call it as endometrium. Endometrium is a bag-like structure. Okay. So, this e blood vessels are formed. Suppose fertilization is not there, it is a zygote embryo, it is a embryo bandhu, agate, further develop. It is not the baby starts to develop in this region. So, that the concept is that it develop the baby, ge, it needs nutrition and uh, uh, the oxygen, all those things it needs. So, that the process is that every month uterus is prepared. But, yavaga fertilize agala egg, yavaga fertilize agala, yavaga sperm meet agala, aga egg fertilize agala. So, anta on the time ali yen agate egg bandhu illi reach agate. So, it will wait for few more days and yen agate finally yavaga fertilization agala anta gutta agate. This endometrium wall, the blood vessels will break down and it will discharge as blood and mucus. Blood hagu mucus agi horagade barate. Aam on the process na we call it as menstruation cycle. So, if you have a fertilization, you should know it. So, now we have a function. I told about. So, I told about the pair of ovaries. So, under the yellow ovary, so ovary in a function, you know, ovaries function, one of the sex cells under egg na release, one of the female hormone, estrogen and progesterone release. So, fallopian tube na function, you know, first of all, fallopian tube in the ovary na uterus jate connect. And the ovary there. Illi uterus, how the 
ಸೊ ಇದೆರಡನ್ನು ಕನೆಕ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡುವಂಥ ಒಂದು ರೀಸನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಆಸ್ ಸೈಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಫರ್ಟಿಲೈಸೇಷನ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ನೀವೇನು ತಿಳ್ಕೊಳ್ಬೇಕು ಯು ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ನೋ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಯುಟ್ರಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಎಟ್ ಯುಟ್ರಪ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಆ್ಯಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಅ ಪಿಯರ್ ಶೇಪ್ಡ್ ಮಸ್ಕ್ಯುಲರ್ ಆರ್ಗನ್ ನಾನು ಹೇಳಿದೆ ನಿಮಗೆ ಅದೊಂದು ಬ್ಯಾಗ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಸ್ಟ್ರಕ್ಚರ್ ಥರ ಇದೆ ಅಂತ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ ಹೆಲ್ಪ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಡೆವಲಪ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಂಬ್ರಿಯೋ ಅಂದರೆ ಫ್ಯೂಚರಲ್ಲಿ ಡೆವಲಪ್ ಆಗುವಂಥ ಒಂದು ಎಂಬ್ರಿಯೋಗೆ ಏನು ಮಾಡುತ್ತೆ ಹೆಲ್ಪ್ ಮಾಡುತ್ತೆ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಯು ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ನೋ ಅಬೌಟ್ ದ ಸರ್ವಿಕ್ಸ್ ಸರ್ವಿಕ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನೋದು ಒಂದು ನ್ಯಾರೋ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ನೀವು ಇಲ್ಲಿ ನೋಡ್ಬೋದು ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ನ್ಯಾರೋ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಹ್ಯೂರ್ ಯು ಕೆನ್ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ಸಿ ಸರ್ವಿಕ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ನ್ಯಾರೋ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಸರ್ವಿಕ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಫೈನಲಿ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಆಸ್ ವೆಜೈನ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಈ ಎಲ್ಲ ಫಂಕ್ಷನ್ಸನ್ನು ಕೂಡ ನೀವು ತಿಳ್ಕೊಳ್ಬೇಕು ಸರ್ವಿಕ್ಸ್ನ ಫಂಕ್ಷನ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ನ್ಯಾರೋ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ದ ಯುಟ್ರಸ್ ಯುಟ್ರಸನ್ನು ಎಕ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಡ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ಸೊ ವೆಜ್ನ ಏನು ಮಾಡುತ್ತೆ ಇಟ್ ಹೆಲ್ಪ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಪಾಸಿಂಗ್ ದ ಸ್ಪರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಸ್ಪರ್ಮ್ಸಿನ ವೆಜಾಯ್ನಾಯಿಂದ ಫೆಲೋಪಿಯನ್ ಟ್ಯೂಬ್ಗೆ ರೀಚ್ ಮಾಡೋಕ್ಕೆ ಈ ವೆಜಾಯ್ನ ರೀಜನ್ ಹೆಲ್ಪ್ ಮಾಡುತ್ತೆ ಹೋಪ್ ಯು ಆಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟುಡ್ ಇವತ್ತಿನ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ಗೆ ಇಷ್ಟು ಸಾಕು ಇನ್ನು ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸಲ್ಲಿ ನಾನು ನಿಮಗೆ ಈ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟನ್ನು ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ತೀನಿ ಅಂದರೆ ಫರ್ಟಿಲೈಸೇಷನ್ ಯಾವ ರೀತಿ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಫರ್ಟಿಲೈಸೇಷನ್ ಆಗಲಿಲ್ಲ ಅಂದರೆ ಏನಾಗುತ್ತೆ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ತೀನಿ ಸೊ ಕೆಲವೊಂದು ಕ್ವೆಶನ್ಸನ್ನ ಕೂಡ ನಾನು ಇಲ್ಲಿ ನೋಟ್ ಡೌನ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಂಡಿದ್ದೀನಿ ನಿಮಗೆ ಯಾವ ರೀತಿ ಕ್ವೆಶನ್ಸ್ ಕೇಳ್ಬೋದು ಸೊ ಈ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ರಿಲೇಟೆಡ್ ಮೇಲೆ ಅಂದರೆ ಸೊ ಈಗ ಹೇಳಿರುವಂಥ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ಮೇಲೆ ಅಂದರೆ ಇವತ್ತು ಮಾಡಿರುವಂಥ ಒಂದು ಕ್ಲಾಸಲ್ಲಿ ಇದೇ ಮೇ ಆಸ್ಕ್ ಯು ಇನ್ ದ ಹ್ಯೂಮನ್ ಬಾಡಿ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ರೋಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಸೆಮೈನಲ್ ವೆಸಿಕಲ್ ಅಥವಾ ಪ್ರೋಸ್ಟೇಟ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಅಂತ ಕೇಳ್ಬೋದು ಯು ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಪ್ರಿಪೇರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಆಲ್ ದ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ಎವ್ರಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ಈಸಿ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಸೊ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಫೀಲ್ ದಿಸ್ ವಿಡಿಯೋ ಇಸ್ ಯೂಸ್ಫುಲ್ ಕೈಂಡ್ಲಿ ಲೈಕ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಶೇರ್ ಮಾಡಿ ಮ್ಯಾಕ್ಸಿಮಮ್ ನಿಮ್ಮ 